My name is Jenny Welch. On August 4th, 1882, my, my life, life was taken, taken from me. me. I was, I was only, only 17, 17 years, years old. old. My father purchased a great plot in Oak Hill Cemetery, located in Sterling, Massachusetts. I've been coming here to visit Jenny now for 20 years. It all started in the year 2003, when I was pulled to her stone. And when I walked up and looked at her name and read it, there was something very, very familiar about Jenny. I just felt I, I had known this person in another life. I was totally totally convinced. So this is what you do, you trek through. Every day. Do you think Jenny is trying to tell us something? I believe she is. I believe she was murdered, and I believe when the day they buried her, she went into the ground with everybody thinking she took her own life, you know, and it wasn't true. 1882 newspaper clipping in the obituaries that Jenny committed suicide by ingesting Paris Green, which was a, a poison used back in them days. And when I read the obituary, and it said she was unsuccessful on a Friday taking the, the Paris Green, so she ended up taking more the next day to take her life. Well, there was a red flag right away. I thought it wouldn't be possible to take Paris Green one day and then the next day because it only takes less than eighth of a teaspoon of Paris Green to kill a human being. And it's an agonizing, agonizing death. And if you took it, even if you didn't die day number two, you were on your way. There was no turning back. I know Jenny's here. I know I can't see her, I can't touch her, but I can feel her in ways. It's been 140 years and I, Jenny Welch, will not cross over until the truth of my death has been told. I, I'll never stop coming down because I'm pulled. I'm pulled. I couldn't stop even if I wanted to.